Okay, we're on. We're good. Good? Yeah. Okay, alright. First and foremost, I want to say Kyle, how are you? How are you? How are you? Double honors to the Apostles and the Hills of Great Millstone. The salutations to your active pushing this word in truth and sincerity. Alright? Oh, hey, first and foremost, too, also, I want to say that uh, I'm beyond stoked about this election coming up. So I think it's supposed to be on the 8th, so two more days. Yeah. Tuesday. Tuesday, this Tuesday coming up. We're gonna know which one of these devils are gonna put up in office. Cause they're both devils anyways, right? And I believe through the spirit of Yahweh Shimmy on Shai that no matter which one of those devils are put up in office, through them, consciousnesses are gonna be flying, man. Because they're both wicked, they're both looking to make wage war. You know? Both Hillary and uh Look, uh, I'm, I'm gonna make a video on that day, actually, to be honest. I'm gonna make a video on that day about the election. Cause that's I sincerely believe those prophecies are gonna start really flying by when the, one of these guys are in office. You know? Can you uh get for me second Peter six? Two and six? Second Peter's chapter two. Oh no, it's left. Ezekiel. 33 30. This is Ezekiel. Ezekiel chapter 33, verse 30. Also, thou son of man, the children of thy people still are talking against thee by the walls and in the doors of the houses. And guess what? The scoffers of our people are doing exactly that. You know, we will be out here making these videos. Edifying the, the elect, and you got scoffers literally that will that, that will commune with each other and say, Yo, let's let's walk down the street and see what uh, you know. Apostle Hara is saying basically these these uh, scoffers will get together and grab a couple drinks and just walk by just to laugh. Yeah. Because to them it's an amusement. You know, they're being amused. Yeah. We're not out here to amuse people, even though we're a spectacle in the world. Our main priority is to what? Wake up the elect, the hopeful elect, and to work on our own salvation in the mean at the same time. You know, but and it's crazy, it also shows you Israel's wicked, man, because the your own our own people who we're only speaking to are the ones laughing at us and scoffing and talking about us, talking shit about us. And if, if they could, they would want all of us dead. Right? Because those are the same spirits that were in the past, when Yahushai was on the earth, that killed Yahushai and the, and the, and the apostles, mm -hmm. and all the uh, prophets of the Lord. I, I got a quick piece of that. Titus 1 and 10. For there are many unruly and vain talkers, yeah. and deceivers, especially they of the circumcision. <laughs> they have the circumcision, which is deep. And the only people that are the circumcision is Israel. Because you go back to an Abraham, I forgot what that in Genesis. Abraham told, or the Lord told Abraham to circumcise Israel. He even circumcised Ishmael. To circumcise uh, uh, Isaac. Because it's going to be uh, in all of Israel, it's going to be all of Israel's, uh, it's basically going to be a tradition, cultural of Israel. You know? And I forgot that what it was. Um, there was something, there's like an actual, something happens when you go circumcised. Oh yeah, like, uh, something with the blood, right? Yeah, like, uh, it's, uh, you know, um, it has to happen on the eighth day? Yeah. On the seventh day? Yeah, like it's the, you know, I'm a vitamin K, uh, vitamin K, yeah, right? Yes, yes, right? Yes, yes, yes. Uh, and like, you know, yeah. And if you circumcise, you know, your child, like on the sixth or the seventh day, <laughs> any you know? Day, yeah, any day before a week. Yeah. That vitamin K stop. That vitamin K is supposed to stop from bleeding out. Bleeding out, yeah. And you I think that when you're young, you don't build vitamin K until a week later. Mm -hmm. So that's why you're supposed to circumcise your child a week later. Yeah. So that he doesn't bleed out. Exactly. Yeah. And yeah. then also, you know, like it's best to do it when you're young because yeah. you know, as a kid, you know, you don't have that memory. You know. The pain. Yeah. You know, or, or, the, or the pain, but you know, like if you're an adult, you know, you're a grown man. Yo, it's very hard, man, you know, hard thing. you know, like if you see a woman and then, you know, you get hard, yo, that's pain right there. Yeah, you know what I mean? yeah. Yo, the chill, that, yeah. that, shit's, that yeah. shit's tough, right? That's exactly why Paul said, you know, uh, I think it was really, uh, 
revelations that uh, don't let them worry you of your high holy days or your Sabbath days. Because at the time, there was, I think, what, was that Acts 13? Uh, that's, um, that's in Amal. Acts 13, where they're, like, they're arguing, arguing about the, the, yeah, the yeah, Acts, Jews, because they want to get circumcised. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, it's a hard, some of the, Acts. most of the Israelites that... Brothers, how are you guys doing? Good, good. Good. So, a lot of the Israelites that, or the Israelite foreigners, so the Gentile, uh, Israelite Gentiles, had to, uh, were getting, you know, basically pressured by the Israelites who knew they were Israelites to get them circum to be circumcised. Yeah. A lot of them were grown men, you know, like real grown men. So, to get circumcised at an age is a hard thing. So, it, you know, the apostles, I think it was Peter, told them that it takes time. You let them build their spirit up. Because yeah. even right now, man, just being the truth, what, we've been in the truth for two and a half years now? Yeah. We're still babes. Yeah. You know, exactly. there's still things that we'll fall off on. And then we won't do right, but you know, our, our, we try our best, right? It's basically like that. I always, I always, I always say to myself, new, le new levels, new devils, right? Yeah. So every, everybody's in their own lot. Yeah. You know? Yeah. You know, just because, like, you know, like if you see, like, an Egypt come, you know, in, into the truth, mm -hmm. you know, like, you know, you're not supposed to just, just like, you know, I'm a lay, you know, I'm a everything on him yeah. about the laws, you know? Do this, it takes do time, that. right? Oh, oh, it takes time. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Takes time. Yeah, you know, just like, you know, a newborn babe, you know, you're not going to feed him a uh, snake, right? <laughs> yeah, exactly. have no teeth, it's just common them. sense, but, you know, right. you don't do that. But, you know, as they grow in the spirit, you know, as they grow in the spirit, you know, they're going to realize it themselves. Exactly. You know, they're, they're going to start realizing it themselves. And then, guess what, you know, they're going to have to keep it, you know, you know, among themselves. Let every you know? man be persuaded in their own mind. Kind, you know. Like in this thing, like, you know, you you don't want to motivate yeah. someone else, you know. Yeah. Like, you know, yeah. I'm a, you know. Too much motivation is cheating. Kind, you know. It should be something, you know. It should be something, you know. It should be something that they want for themselves. You know, because, you know, at the end of the day, you know, we can't save anybody. Yeah. So, you know, I'm not going to go and, like, you know. I'm not gonna go and like you know I'm gonna hold you know. Your yeah, you know what I mean. I'll you know? tell you, I'll help you. Exactly. But there's only so much we can do. Exactly, man. There's sure. only so much we can do, and at the end of the day, you know, it's on you to know, you know, whether what's you know what's right and what's you know what's wrong. That's right. right. But it's so. I was gonna say too. So you got those same people now. A lot of you got a lot of uh, well, heck, a perfect example, fucking uh, Sakari. That one, that one Jake that fell, the bigger guy, yeah. who, who wore PJs to the camp. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. That guy. <laughs> now he's friends with Sakari. Well, Sakari was yeah. one of those people. Yeah. As soon as he was in the truth, Sakari was against him, talking shit about him. Yeah. And then as soon as he started to slow down, Sakari was right there by his side to be his friend. Yeah. You yeah. know? Yeah. So that's exactly, that's exactly, that's an example of those people. Yeah. And talk shit about us. Exactly. For there are many unruly and vain talkers and deceivers, especially they of the uncircumcision. Uh, so like, especially they of the circumcision. So especially they of Israel. Because huh. Huh. Whose mouths must be stopped. Mouth must be stopped. Who subvert whole houses, teaching things which they ought not. That's right. Like what? The for world is flat. For huh. example. Huh. That was something that was. Israelites that were doing that, not just Israelites, but Israelites that were once in the truth, you know, who, who are now teaching that the, the, they're still teaching that the world's flat. Uh, Sakari, teaching all type of vain things. Well, what was that? We just finished talking about what's his name that said that the Lord was the, uh, homosexual. Uh, yeah. Azar, yeah. he was teaching the Lord was homosexual, like I, that. Uh, and he's an Israelite who was once in the truth. In the truth, you know, that knew the name of the Lord. And that's why the scripture says, trust not thy brother. Yeah. Because you don't actually know who the Lord has planned for the, to be that they elect. You have hope, you have faith that, oh, you know, this brother who's been in the truth with me for 10 years is part of the elect. But there's people who've been in the truth for 10, 12 years, and they fall out. Uh, yeah. It's mind-boggling to fall after 10, 12 years. Uh, you know, and, uh, and fucking, uh, you know, I'm a balloon. You know, this guy's all talking about how, you know, how my guys are living in GMS, you know, and, uh, you know, Apostle Gabari, you know, he made a beautiful video, you know, and he said, you know, yes, you know, you know, um, you know, I'm a, yes, you know, I'm a, there's some guys, you know, who are living in GMS, or, or, you know, or, you know, I'm a, you know, I'm a, these guys, you know, they can curse out, 
But, you know, at the same time, you know, those same men that fell out, they're being replaced. You know, it's the same thing with, uh, it's the same thing with, you know, I'm a Judas, you know, Judas fell out, and then, you know, in the book of Acts, you know, Judas was replaced. You know what I mean? It's the same thing, you know, when one guy falls out, there's four or five other new Akim that comes into the truth. Yo, that's the Lord doing, you know, a cleaning in the house of Israel, man. Well, yeah, well, that's exactly what I was just saying. The Lord said he was sift the house of Israel. That's what he's, that's really all he's doing when he, when, when, uh, when, uh, Jake's fall out of the truth. Mm -hmm. They're leaving GMS because the Lord is uh, literally circumcising the the elect, huh. or the, the the bunch there. Yeah. That's right. And it says, whose mouth must be stopped, who subvert whole houses teaching things which they ought not, for filthy lucre's sake. Yo, that's well, Nate, man. You know, what Nate is doing is for filthy lucre's sake, man. Because, you know, what you get in this kingdom, you know, is uh, temporary, man. Like the scripture says, you know, you want to build, you know, your house, you know, in the heavens, man. You want to build, you know, that, you know, I'm a spiritual riches where, you know, uh, where, you know, I'm a moth and rust, you know, that's not corrupt, man. You know, because, you know, like uh, fucking, uh, you know, I'm a general, you know, I'm a Gehenna. This guy said it, he said it plainly. We have to build our kingdom in this kingdom. That's what that nigga said, man. You know, he said we he said we have to build the kingdom of Israel in this kingdom. Plainly, man. You know, but he has men, uh, you know, I'm a general Gehenna, man. Of the, you know, ISUPK, man. But then, you know, he has a bunch of followers, you know, that are blind. Like, you know, the the, the guy literally said that we gotta build our kingdom in Israel's kingdom. That's confusion, man. Yeah, how about you should start out of confusion? That is, you know, madness and that's confusion. But you know, it's the same moving in, that's moving in with the devil. Moving in with the devil, man. You can't get comfortable in here, man. This is Esau's kingdom. But again, you know, these guys, you know, they lost patience. That's why the scripture says, "Warn to you that have lost patience." That's right? The spirit. That's exactly that's so, it, man. Bro, I got you. That's the <laughs> yeah. spirit. I was just thinking just that. Just thinking that. They lose this because of patience. Yeah. And when they, and and. And the reason why they lose patience because they lack faith. Exactly. There's, yo, there's no you know, faith, you know? There's no faith. Because faith will make you patient. Yeah. It will make you suffer. Exactly. When you have faith. When you have faith, you'll go through the hell that you need to go through to see the kingdom. To see the kingdom. Huh, you know? Yeah, you know, just like the, like, you know, I'm a 2000, you know, I'm a, you know, I'm a, you know, I'm a thingy. Where, you know, I'm a, you know. Yeah, you know, like, you know, I'm a, the apostle said that the Lord was going to come, you know. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah, like in the year 2000, and then you know after that, you know, you know thousands and thousands of men fell out, you know, yeah. that goes to show you, you know, Big, yeah, uh, sifting, right? Yeah. That goes to show you, you know, that these guys, you know, they truly did not believe, yeah. you know, and they were just waiting to see what would happen, you know. Like you know, uh, I got a piece of that actually, but uh, yeah, uh, I was actually just gonna. It was just yeah, it was just to prove, you know what? Yeah, because it's just to prove that when it when he read I'll try you read your piece of first now. I need to read that okay. Okay. after Khan. Khan. This is um this is Luke 17 and 22. And he said unto unto the disciples that days will come when ye shall desire to see Salatia, when you shall desire to see one of the days of the Son of Man, and you shall not see it. See? That's exactly what happened see? in the year 2000, man. Yeah, you that's know? exactly what happened. You know, yo, yo, basically, you know, you know, that was a fulfillment of prophecy. Yeah, that really right? was. That's exactly what it was. That was a yeah. fulfillment of prophecy when yeah. apostles they desired to see the Lord, yeah. but they didn't get to see it, man. <laughs> yeah, that's you right. know, but the main thing is what you gotta do. You know, as a servant of the Lord, you know, just because you didn't see it doesn't mean that you gotta stop serving Yahweh by Shai. Right. You know, if you stop serving Yahweh by Shai, that means that you're, that means that you you're know, never in the truth exactly, you were never in the truth, and, and you know, and uh, and and yeah, you know, you're never in the truth, you know, like, and also you know, you're not a servant of Yahweh Shai, man. Like you know, last week we were talking about the such thing as unconditional love, but, yeah. but there is a such thing as unconditional loyalty, man. Huh. You have to be, there should be no conditions to your loyalty to the Lord. Yeah. Especially being the truth. Yeah. Because with faith, because with, with the Lord, He went through all that hell He had to go through. There was time where He, 
remember when he prayed on the Mount of Gethsemane to the Lord three times, like, I'm not, I don't want to do this. Is there any other way? You know, the Lord said no. The Lord didn't answer him. Huh. Three times. Huh. You know, but he's showing you that those guys were on such a carnal level, man. They, they were not, they were more carnal than spiritual, if anything. Huh. Because as soon as they heard that, okay, you know, the whole 2000 thing, the computer's going to shut down, okay, now I can get out of here. As soon as they happen, okay, well, I'm done now. It's too late. I can't wait. Yeah, exactly. What if Yahweh Shai did that? Yeah. What if Yahweh Shai's like, no, I can't do this anymore. I'm leaving. Yeah, I'm done. We'll be all fucked. Exactly, man. So Yahweh Shai went through it completely. Mm -hmm. We gotta do the exact same thing. Kind. Or, you know, or also, like, another example, you know, when the Lord, you know, uh, when the Lord Yahweh Shai, like, you know, when I'm, like, when the Lord went, went up to pray, you know, in the mountains, you yeah. know, and the disciples fall asleep, you know, yeah, and huh. then, and then, you know, and then, you know, and then, you know, and then, you know, the Lord came back, you know, and basically, like, you know, the, the, the Lord got mad. Yeah. He's like, what the hell, you can't know? Stay you can't even stay with me for hours? Can't for what hours? That's exactly yo, what happened. That's exactly what happened, is that, you know, yo, you know, you know, basically, you know, I'm a, that was like, you know, I'm a, you know, I'm a something, you know. Shadowing. Exactly, you know. Yeah, man, you know, that's deep because yeah. at this time, you know, when the Lord returns, you know, his, you know, the Lord is going to find, you know, man's, you know, who, sleeping. who are still going to be asleep, yeah. man. You know, that's, that, that was exactly deep, man. what those guys did. Bro. Yeah. When they fell out, they just went back to sleep. The, yeah. So they couldn't stay up with the Lord. Exactly. You know? When man. he comes back, he's going to be just as pissed as he was pissed back out. then. Yeah. Well, even more pissed that's now right. than he was back then. At that's the con. And, and the Lord said that he comes as a thief in the night. The Lord, yo, the Lord's not going to tell you when he's going to come. You know, that's why the Lord, the Lord, easy for us. Con, that, that, that's why the Lord is going to come as a thief in the night. Just so that, you know, you know, you know, basically like, you know, I'm going to just so that, you know, the Lord, you know, just so that the Lord can ca catch, you know, I'm like, these guys off guard, man. Yeah, catch himself, right? You know? Because even the Lord, like, you know, Lord Yahweh Shai, he doesn't even know when he's coming down. Yeah. Lord, the, the, <laughs> Yahweh's just going to send him down, and he's just going to go. Kind. You know? Kind. That's right. Uh, One second.